Welcome to Mechanismaler's video tutorials. Simple pneumatic devices not only increase the productivity but also create a better working environment for workers. Here is a pneumatic system which dispenses grease on circular parts. This job used to be completed manually by a couple of workers, was time consuming and dirty. Once the automated system was in operation, the productivity of the operation increased tenfold. Also working condition was better since the workers hands were not greasy anymore. And there was a significant cost savings due to decreased demand for hand degreasing products. The system you see in this video consists of three valves, two pneumatic cylinders and one electric motor. The rotation of the electric motor is controlled by an electronic device. During the operation the motor rotates continuously. The three-port two-way foot operated valve starts the cycle when the operator steps on it. The pneumatic signal coming from this foot operated valve actuates five ports four-way valve shown in here. This valve in turn actuates the pneumatic cylinder which pushes the parallel arm system. The parallel arm system brings the grease syringe, made of a pneumatic cylinder, close to the part. At the last moment lower arm of the device actuates another three-port two-way valve which sends pressurized air to the cap end of the syringe. Notice that the grease is stored in the needle section of the syringe. The needle consists of a small pipe and a nozzle attached at the tip of it. Whenever pressurized air is applied to the syringe, the grease is pushed out from the nozzle. Notice that the piston inside the cylinder is advancing very slowly forward due to viscosity of the grease. Also, when the foot pedal released, the high pressure on the piston is lifted. This stops the grease from dispensing, but the piston will not return at its original position. For each time operator presses the pedal, the piston will go forward, but it will not return to its original position. Let's show this concept by pressing the pedal many times, as though we are greasing a new part for each forward motion. Notice that the piston is advancing slowly and we can guess the level of the grease in the syringe from the piston rod. When there is less grease in the syringe, the piston rod sinks inward. When all the grease in the syringe is used the operator connects the syringe to a grease pump and pumps more grease into the syringe. This is very simple system, but it was so successful that even after 30 years it is still in operation. When I saw it in operation after so many years, I was delighted, but never expected it to last that long. I hope this solution may be useful for someone who has the same problem. Thank you for watching our videos, we encourage you to subscribe to our channel and give a thumb up to our videos.